Hey guys, Ryu here with none of it for Blender. This one's gonna be in correspondence to the previous video I posted regarding the new update for Box Cutter. And this one I'm gonna show you a really cool kind of a hidden trick. So now with the new box cutter, when you're gonna go to snap and you're gonna go here and enable static snap and let's just enable this alignment preview. When I'm gonna hold control, you'll see the dots uh, around the selected face, the face you're hovering over. And kind of like a preview of, uh, you know, of a cutter here. Now when I'm gonna hold control, right, and I'm gonna start drawing, you can see that my cut is going from below this edge. So when I'm going to actually cut it, you'll see that I'm gonna get a bit of a problem. So I need to go to Boolean and, you know, turn an exact to make it actually work. But there's a kind of a walk around here okay and I want to show you that so the first thing I'm going to show you is how to fix this uh, problem with this cut yeah so you hold control you draw a cut and then you press alt and this will actually allow you to draw a cut uh, you know in this fashion but there is a specific way of drawing it so you need to hold control then you click then you drag then you press alt and you keep holding alt you release control but you still hold alt then you release your mouse and then you draw and then you click okay and one more time, control, drag, alt, release control, release mouse, you know, cut, and then release alt, and click, okay? Another trick I want to show you is um, evolving around the um, snap grid, um, kind of like a subdivision preview, so I've got to enable this one. You don't really need this one, but I'm going to enable it just to show you something really cool. And you're going to hold control and press shift and then scroll your mouse to, you know, enable this grid. You can release it. It's going to stay there until you press escape. Okay, so one more time. Draw it. Cool. And now I'm going to start, you know, uh, let's say I want to draw from this um, dot. And my dot, my cutter is going to snap to dots, right? And when I press alt, it's going to get mirrored to every single um, side. Because a box cutter now is drawing from the middle um, of this uh, of this uh, cut, which means it's actually uh, mirroring across the point from which you started to draw. So one more time, if I go on and go here, press Alt, you're gonna get this. However, if I'm gonna do the same thing and press, sh let's say I'm gonna drag here and I'm going to press Shift, it's actually gonna create a square out of it. Okay, so watch this. I can draw in here. Press Shift, square. It's gonna make a square in the direction of your of your draw. Yeah, see what I mean? So now it's gonna go down. And here's gonna go up and this by the way it works with alt so you can create a perfect square that's gonna snap to these uh, to these dots all right guys that's it uh, have fun with this one uh, links to hard ups and box cutter in the video description thank you for watching catch you in the next one